The Buccaneers held a walkthrough practice today without Antonio Brown. Brown has dominated the headlines as of late, but the Bucs still have a big game to play on Sunday. ABC Action News sports anchor Kyle Berger breaks down how a win this week could help their Super Bowl chances. The Buccaneers are currently the number three seed in the NFC, which guarantees at least one home playoff game. Uh, you want to be the highest seed that you possibly can be, and we have a chance to move up in the seeding, so uh, that's very important. But a win Sunday coupled with a Rams loss, the Bucs would move to the second seed and could play at least two games on the home field. The Bucs play a Panthers team this Sunday, a team they beat 32 to 6 just two weeks ago. This is a copycat league and teams are finding ways to repeat plays against us and we have not stopped them. And so this is going to be a big test for us going against a team that wants to run the ball. Right when you slack off, you can get slapped right in the face and, uh, and because you're not prepared. Uh, that's happened before. The Bucs are banged up and bruised going into the regular season finale. Leonard Fournette, Levante David and Shaq Barrett are all trending to return to the team just in time for the playoffs. But outside this Bucks locker room, there's doubt that this team can repeat as Super Bowl champs. At the same time, I mean, we've been there before now. So, um, you know, they counted us out last year. You know, it's, that's, it's, it's almost like what they, that's what they're supposed to do. Antonio Brown is still on the official roster after quitting the team at mid-game on Sunday. Head coach Bruce Arian said the front office is working out a way to handle a transaction to officially sever ties. In Tampa, Kyle Berger, ABC Action News.